inconsistency has plagued the team from the Cape. They currently lie in ninth place on the Premier Soccer League and with seven matches to play are determined to play in next year's top eight competition. I think the season has been uh, like a roller coaster for us, you know, um, a lot of good things but also a lot of bad things. Um, but, you know, we as players, we, we, we are looking to get into the top eight, you know, uh, especially after uh, being reigning champions. And, you know, um, if you're not there next season, it's going to look quite silly. Last week, the SAR accompanied two promising young footballers, Abubakar Mabara and Tasrik Morris, to train with mother club Ajax Amsterdam and to share coaching knowledge expertise with the Dutch club's coach, Frank de Boer. The trip for Amsterdam was mainly to take the two players with me and also, you know, to sort of get me to meet some of the staff over there and, and get to see the system on that side. It was It's always a fantastic experience and you're always going to learn from clubs like that. But for the players, it was good too. The players had a, had a great time. They had a good experience. They did impress. They, 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 I thought they were pretty good. Obviously, it's something that we've got to wait and see now. After a month-long break, Ajax have a tough week ahead against third-place Platinum Stars and then against the mighty Amakosi. Platinum Stars, have had, I think they've had a fantastic season. I think almost unnoticed they've arrived into third position and nobody really noticed them arriving there. They've got a very good side with a, with a very good coach. Kevin is a, is a real you know, a football uh, you know, fanatic and uh, he's done a great job there. Ajax have seven matches left to make a roller coaster season a good one. Craig Murray, SABC News, Cape Town.